praise God. I was listening to Christ crucified the entire way over here, just on repeat. Just Christ crucified, Christ crucified, Christ crucified. And we're all here in this room, but not just in this room, but where we are in life because of Christ crucified. Amen. Amen. Isn't that glorious? Amen. Just to turn our hearts again to that truth that never runs dry and that never gets old. It's two words and it's everything. Christ crucified. You now the love of God is manifest. It's made known to us in this and that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us on the cross. Hallelujah. Something just supernatural happens in my heart when I begin to tap into this, when I just begin to once again align my heart with this essential truth that God came, wrapped himself in human flesh, lived a perfect, sinless life because he loved us so much. Taking on himself the form of a servant. And then he was crucified. And he bled. God bled. And here we are, all ransomed. All known. And all getting to better know that God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, no one even needs to stand up here. This is everything, isn't it? It's everything. Christ crucified. It's everything. It's rivers and rivers of living water welling up into eternal life. Hallelujah. Wow. Wow. The worship has already begun, hasn't it? It's already started. Whose heart has already started to come up and be bask in the glory of God? Hallelujah. 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 You know how hard it is for me to move on right now, but I have to? So we will transition, but we're never transitioning, right? We'll never get, it'll never get any greater. We'll never be able to fully possess this amazing truth of who our God is, what he's done for us, what he's doing for us, and what he will do. Oh my, hallelujah. Jesus, Jesus. Jesus. I want to say Jesus nights, but I also want to say Jesus days. I also want to say Jesus all the time. I want to say hallelujah, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. You know, every time I look at the Holy Spirit, you know what I see? I see Jesus. I see Jesus. So we're not going to move on from that. We're going to see if we can do some things. But uh, I just wanted to talk a little bit about where we've come from. You know, Evangelist Jacob and I and uh, his amazing wife, Alicia, and their kids, and, and our, our Christ Foundation's team, Alex Worm, who can't be here tonight, or to, uh, the director of uh, Christ Foundation's Caribbean. You know, we've, we've come here because God does this amazing thing with us. He, he, he pierces our hearts for somewhere, and he makes it impossible for us to do anything except for go there. And then begin, then begin in relationship with a place and with the people that he's called us to go and spend time with and meet and join together with for his sake. So Ignite the Fire is the, the vehicle for that. It's the, the brand you could call it. It is, it is the umbrella that we're coming underneath in order to join with you for something that God wants to do, that, that Christ wants to do. Who knows that he's worthy of everything that we can do? Just worthy of everything. I mean, I just feel the joy of God, the fact that we're all in this room. We can be anywhere. This is a choice. This is a choice. You know what? The little boy chose to give his loaves and his fishes. He chose to do that. He made a choice for that. And then you see what came of it. He gave something up. He's the only one that seemed to have anything, but he gave what he had. The only one that the disciples could find. He, 
Who knew that God was accepting job applications in that moment? <laughs> the criteria was, what will you give? Just what will you give? And this little boy's, well, I got a few fishes, and I got a couple of loaves, and God's like, you're hired. And that's another thing that joins us all together, is that we've got a couple of fishes, we've got a couple of loaves, and I just hear the Lord, you're hired. Come on, I have profitable labor for you. So we've come here together, we are giving our loaves and our fishes to Jesus Christ to do something amazing with, because he loves K-Man. See how I can pronounce it right, isn't it amazing? Yeah. Don't worry. And so here we are because he loves K-Man, and he loves us, and he loves the lost. You know, he died for them, and he's worthy. He's worthy of the reward of his suffering. Amen? Amen. Amen. So we're going to talk about some... It all comes back to this, he's worthy. And it all comes back to this, loaves and fishes. So we have some... Uh, uh, you know, there's some amazing worship that's going to happen. We have, uh, we're going to talk about some practicalities as the night goes forth. Pastor Justin French has a word. You know, you might want to stay sitting because from what I hear, you might fall down if you don't. But he's going to bring a word from the Lord. And I have something very special that he's going to share with us tonight. Uh, and I just want to say it's a joy to be in the house of God with you. It's a joy to be in the fields laboring with you. What is happening? Unbelievable. We get to serve this God. You know, we're stepping into the supernatural work of the supernatural creator of all things in this hour, partnering with him for a time such as this. Hallelujah. So I just want to pray. So if we could all just lift our hands to the Lord real quick. Jesus, we love you. We bless you. We thank you, God. We just invite you right now. You are the King of glory, the Lord of hosts, God Almighty, wonderful counselor, Prince of Peace. You are the fourth man in the fire, the one who has sacrificed and died for us and gives us joy like endless living water flowing out from our innermost being. You are the guest of honor. We're here for you, God. Anything that we can do to welcome you, Lord, I pray you put it on our hearts today because we love you. We love you, God, and we give you glory. Bless everyone here tonight. We pray special uh Prayer and blessing, God, over Reverend French, Lord. He's going to come, Lord, and I know you've given him a special message, so I pray your spirit be upon him, Lord. Manifest Jesus, Lord, and the message that he has for all of us today, tonight, this evening, for your glory, Lord, because we love and treasure you. We make way. Move in our midst, Holy Spirit. We invite you. Show us Jesus. Show us Jesus. We love you so much. You are incredible, Lord, and you're worthy. You're worthy. You're worthy, Jesus. We bless you, Lord. In Jesus' precious name. Amen.